So, in an election, every party promises spending on specific sectors mm -hmm. of the electorate while assuring they will balance the budget. How and when will your party do that? Well, so we were very clear with Canadians in 2015 that we were going to run small deficits over the last four years um, and try to get to a balanced budget. Um, you know, we believe that investing in Canadians and ensuring that we have a robust economy is the best way to build our economy. And we've seen that over the past four years. We have record job growth. We have the lowest unemployment rate in 40 years. We have lowered the debt to GDP ratio with the lowest debt to GDP ratio out of the G7. You know, Canada is doing well economically. Not for everyone. We have to do better, right? There's always better that can be done, and that's you know the commitment that we make to Canadians. But overall, we know that when we've brought in measures like the Canada Child Benefit that's lifted 300,000 Canadian kids out of poverty, that's meaningful, right? That's people putting money directly back into the economy, and we've seen that with the jobs numbers. When we increase the guaranteed income supplement for our most vulnerable seniors by 10%, that's another 50,000 seniors that have been lifted out of poverty. When we reduce the eligibility age for old age security from 67 to 65, that kept hundreds of thousands of Canadian seniors out of poverty. We know that when we help our most vulnerable, when we invest in Canadians and we trust them, our economy will grow and that's what's most important. Every party <coughs> promises spending mm -hmm. on specific sectors of the electorate while assuring they will balance the budget. Mm -hmm. How and when will your party do that? Well, we've uh, just become the first party to release the costing of our platform uh, that was reviewed by the Parliamentary Budget Officer. And we submitted more pieces of our platform for uh, analysis than any other party. And uh, one of the important pieces of that is to make sure that our promises can be met. And they're not through cuts to services that we want. We do believe in balancing the budget, but we want to eliminate tax loopholes and subsidies to fossil fuel companies and make sure that companies like Amazon and Google, which are currently not paying tax at all in Canada, are being brought in line with uh, paying their fair share to the community. So our platform, I believe, is one that uh, balances the budget without putting more burden on Canadians or cutting the services they depend on. And I think that's important to folks. Thank you. In an election, every party promises spending on specific sectors of the electorate while assuring they will balance the budget. How and when will your party do that? So. One of our main areas, so balancing the budget has been an issue for the last 40 years. Um, we always seem to be in a deficit. Uh, we're going from one party to the next. Um, maybe it's time for change and picking a new party to lead the government. Um, one area for sure is taxing the wealthy. So people making over $20 million in net income, if we uh, tax them at 1% extra, um, it will get a revenue of $69 billion. So that money can go into more social programs. It can help alleviate the deficit that we have and move forward as a country. Thank you.